Look at that. Get a little one. Oh, tiny. This is a new record for the smallest fish I've ever caught. The smallest bass I've ever caught. Look at that. The little bitty. Looks like a Guadalupe. I can't really tell. I got another one. Look at the way this thing's been in the rod. <laughs> My recording. Okay. Bring them over here. Bending the hard, the rod, more than any other fish I've caught, but he's not fighting as hard. He's not quite as heavy, I don't think. Nah, that's it. Not a bad one either. <laughs> Get the hook out of his mouth there. Four point five four. Look at that. I just added a big swim bait to the little spinner. There we go. Oh. I missed him. Had a bite from the spot over there. Oh, no, no, maybe I got him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You got him. And he's on the reeds. Man, he's, this reel, this reel didn't even want to bring him in. It's a good size. Yeah, probably about a pound. <laughs> A little spinner with the Biolab swim bait I just put on it to give it some. Dude, look at this hook. Hook set, man, barely. It's barely in the edge of the lip. This thing here. Dag on it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I don't know, according to this, he's almost two pounds. But yeah, it's a little, it's probably a little off. I'd say a pound and a half, maybe a little less. There's a catfish right there. It's a little one, probably a pound and a half, two pounds. But he's over here looking for the chicken. Not disappoint him. Just give him what he's looking for. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm gonna go with a hot dog here. Just because. Where'd he go? I guess I spooked him away when I turned around. Wow, already. That was pretty quick. I wasn't expecting that. It's not a bad one either. It's, it's a little bigger than I thought he was going to be. Unless this is a different one. Man, he was barely hooked, too. 
Uh, probably about four or five pounds. Not a bad looking fish. Ah. Uh, okay. Finally, 3.56. No? Yeah, 3.56. Three, three and a half pounds. There's one. I got him. Wow, this is putting up a good fight. This is the uh, biggest one I've seen out here. Man, wow. Can't believe I actually got this one. This is a good, decent fish. Wow. Got some battle scars on them too. This is one worth getting a weight on. This is a keeper size right here. Man, look at this. All right, it's not that big. This one's probably pound, pound and a half. It's got a big scar right down the right side of his, or the left, yeah, his right side there. I said a pound and a half, he is 1.70. 1.70. Oh, oh, I got one. That's a good one. You see that? That's a really nice one. <laughs> uh, it's not that big, he's just putting up a fight. Oh, he... Probably a... Uh, four pound one here and I got him in the lip so I'll be able to get my hook back I hate it when they swallow it so and I got this guy I got him up on land oh, there we go 4.29 which it's not that big it's not my personal best but it's a good one i'll take it oh oh whoa come on stay on that's a good one ah that is man <laughs> i wasn't even paying attention that is a nice one this might be the best one i've caught out here If it's, this is the same fish I caught last time. I've caught this fish twice. Look at that scar down the right side, down the right side of his body there. <laughs> this is the same fish I caught last time. Let's see if he's gained any weight. Last time he was 1.7, I think. Might have to look up the old video. But that is hilarious. First time I caught him on a crankbait. This time I got him on a Senko. Oh yeah, yeah, he's he's gained a little bit of weight. He's 1.75 now. 1.7, this is a nice fish. And this is why you release fish, because look at that, that, I couldn't even bring him in this time. He was fighting so hard. This is awesome. This is the same exact fish I caught the last time. And I really hope that scar comes out in this picture. Come on, you're coming straight to it. Come on. Got him. Got him. Oh, yeah. 
Yes. Dude, this is a mess. This is a this is my personal best. If I can land him and get a weight on him. Anyway. <laughs> yes. Good catfish. Come on. He's rolling around. I got him. Look at this. I can't even pick him up off the ground with this. Man. And I caught him on a piece of chicken fat. Not a bad channel cat. Uh, 5.97. Personal best as far as ones that I've gotten a weight on. Look at the belly on that thing. I've caught, I've hooked bigger ones, but I've never been able to land them or get a weight on them anyway. Man, you know, I think he almost broke my scale there. Is that a fish? Oh yeah, that's a fish. Already, it's jumping around down in there. First cast. Not a bad one, not a bad one at all. This is a nice one. For this area, I mean, I mean, it's probably, you know what, this might be the biggest one I've caught out here. Look at that. Not a bad fish at all, I like that, that's nice. This is the biggest one I've caught out here. see here oh no look at that two pounds 2.01 pounds this is the biggest uh spotted bass i've caught out here this actually might be my personal best for spotted bass period so 2.01 that is this is the biggest fish i've caught out of this park on the first cast today Oh my God, I can't believe I got that one. Oh man, that's a nice one. Oh, on the crankbait that I found. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the one I found. Of course, I got it tangled up on me there. Ah. Job, man. Not quite as big as I thought he was, but nice. he's a little deformed in the mouth. Yeah, I saw that. Uh, I was it was running along the surface. See where the the hole is in the yeah. green. It jumped up through the stuff and hit it. Nice. You gonna get a weight on him? Yeah, I look at mouth. Yeah, he's got a deformed mouth. This is bigger than the other one. Yeah, for sure. Two and a half. Yeah. <laughs> You able to get it? Yeah. That's fine. You good right there. <laughs> I'm gonna go by the where the bench used to be.